Hello everyone, it's Kelsey here. Welcome and welcome back to my channel, Budget Better Life, where I budget, cash stuff, and save for a less stressful, more enjoyable life. If that sounds great and you can relate, thank you for watching. Alrighty everyone, so today we are cash stuffing and I am doing cash stuffing for week two of March. Now I am filming a little bit out of order because I didn't film my minis video first, but there's a good reason for that. So let's go ahead and just get the money out. We will count it and see how much we have to cash stuff today. So I have 100, 253, 54, 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 710, 25, 35, 45, 55. So we've got $755 to cash up this week. So let's go ahead and set this money up. All right, and there it is. Our cash is set. So what I wanna do is start with my bills binder. Every week I stuff my bills binder and I break my months up into four. So four weeks, that's how I have been doing it. And so I definitely wanna hit these Bills categories first, make sure that all the bills money is where it needs to be. So for rent, we do $150. So let's go ahead and do 150. And so I have 100, 250, 300 in rent so far. So halfway through the month, halfway to our goal. Perfect. And then the Kia will get 150 as well. So I've got 150 here. And I will add this in and the Kia should have 300 as well. So 100, 250, 300 for the car payment, which is perfect. All right. So then the next one is AT&T and AT&T gets 20, 40. Sometimes I like to keep the nice ones. You guys know if you've been around my channel at all, you know, I like to keep the really nice bills for the savings challenges. So we'll add in 20, 40 and we have 60, $80 in AT&T so far. Perfect. Now this next one is progressive, which is my car insurance. And we will do $40 into progressive this week as well. And this one does get saved for six months. So in progressive, we have 150, 70, 90, 210, 230, 240 in progressive, which is perfect. So we'll drop that down in. And then the next one is storage. Now this one gets $30. So let's do a 20 and a 30. So we will add this in. And this is for our storage unit that is holding our furniture right now until we get a new house. So we have 20, 40, 50, 60 dollars in storage, which is great. And then the next one is subscriptions. Now subscriptions gets 40 dollars as well. So we'll do 20, 40 and we will add it in here and we should have 80, 20, 40, 60, 80 dollars in subscriptions, which is perfect. This is for all of my subscriptions and any auto withdrawing bills for the month. And then my wife's braces, now she gets 50, 60, that one's kind of nice. Yeah, let's keep it, and five. All right, so how about this five? I like it. So we're doing 50, 65 in braces. Perfect, let's get this out. And we will add this in and we now have 100, uh, 50, 100, 10, 25, 30. So $130 in braces so far, which is perfect. All right. And then once we stuff my personal spending, I will have the rest go into the savings envelope. So let's go ahead and close this one up and we will go ahead. We're not doing this yet. <laughs> And we'll do this one. Okay, so this binder comes from Budget with Ira. It's really beautiful and it has my personal spending envelopes. So these are the envelopes I come to throughout the week to spend in cash. And I'm gonna do $20 in gas this week. Perfect. And groceries is getting skipped. We already pulled our 100 and spent it. I actually had the money set aside in the cash tray and just grabbed the 100 and went to the store before I could even film because we needed to stock up. We were severely low on groceries. All right, spending, we usually do 20, 
$40, so $20.40 a week in spending. And this is for me and my wife to get a few things that we want throughout the week. So that is spending. Household gets $50 and it will get this last $50 bill right here. Fun is not getting anything this week and miscellaneous always gets a $5 bill. So we will do that. Then we've got a little bit extra money and I wanted to see how much we had to save this week because I do want to try to get back to Hello Honey and I want to put some extra money towards Hello Honey. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100, and 5, 10, 15, 25. So I have $125 extra that's going to go towards savings this week. And I normally do my save fives, I do a save 10 and a save 20 and I do the solo. And then I have my mini binders that I do as well. But I have to catch up on Hello Honey and I have a 45. And then this week I caught up all the way up to current and I got a 24 and a 14 and an eight. So that's 40, just kidding. I definitely did math wrong. 45 plus 24 plus 14 plus eight equals. So that's $91, doll hairs is what I wanted to say. I wish it was only doll hairs, right? Yeah, that's a lot of money. So um, 20, 40, 60, 80, hmm. All right, let's at least do, it's so tough because I want to put money towards these, but I think I, think I would, I'm gonna skip these for this week. I'm gonna skip all of these oh i don't want to skip this one though yeah maybe i do i'll catch up later okay so i'm skipping this binder i'm not doing savings challenges in here but one binder that i just absolutely can't skip because i've been going so strong and so consistent on it is this binder here from caffeine and budgets and this is um it's like a monthly challenge i've already completed january and february and for march i did 35 dollars so far so i wanted to do the 25 plus the 10 for 35 dollars and that's what i'm going to do so let's go ahead and do 10 plus 25 for 35 dollars so let's go 20 30 and five so 20 35 in here and i will just add it into what is already in here perfect i have 20 40 50 65 70 so 70 dollars so far in the envelope for march which is right here so let's drop it all down in and then this binder is set. So let's go ahead and close this one up. And then the next one I wanna make sure that I do is this one here, because I think last week I counted and I had, I think it was 12 panels left. So I definitely don't wanna skip a week on this because I'm gonna be so excited when this one gets complete. So I'm gonna pull out a nice 20, a nice crispy 20 right there. I've got this nice crispy 10. And then a really good looking five right here. So let's just go ahead and fold these up and we will slide them in. Now this binder came from the Budgeting Baker. Um, and if you guys like mini binders, I have really been enjoying this one. I love stuffing like mini binders. So this one is fun. I've got a lot of good mini binders on my Etsy shop. I've done a couple of them and I'm excited to get back to um, maybe one of my color roll mini binders. Um, once I finish this one and once I finish this mini binder from Ira, I think I will bust out maybe the 1K one, which would be really fun. Um, so yeah, I'm just excited to keep going on these mini binders and really get somewhere on them. So let's go ahead and slide the 20 in its place and we'll take a look at the front and see how this panel looks. We got our five, we got our 10, and we got our 20. It looks beautiful. All right, so let's close this up and then leaves me with 45.55. So it is not, 
as much as I wanted to go towards Hello Honey, but it's something. And you know what? If I can't complete Hello Honey this week, I can't do it. But I did what I could. I'm going to skip this little mini binder from Ira for this week. And again, I skipped those other challenges that were in the purple binder. So now what we can do is take this money and we can pop it in the back here into the savings envelope. And instead of saving this for when I do savings challenges next, I am going to pull this when I do my minis video. So 20, 40, 45, 50, 55. So I've got $55 being set aside for Hello Honey. And I will pull that in my very next video. And that is it. A very short and sweet cash stuffing with a little bit of savings this week. And I hope you guys enjoyed. I know I did. I have so much fun when I get to stuff those mini binders. It's just such a satisfying way to save money because you just can't wait until the moment that you get to unstuff them. So that is what I'm looking forward to. So I hope that you guys subscribe to my channel if you haven't already so that you don't miss when I finally do complete some of those challenges. But that is going to be it for today's video. And other than that, I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.